We thank God for his protection. I greet you in Jesus' name. I am still talking about the ability to see. Yedanyamia si e woni bambo e hu. Mi chia wo Yesu di mu. Mi gusuara e kasafa de betumi amo hu na de ye e hu. Let's hear the heavens report for today. Because I love you, that is why I came down to the earth to show you my way that will give you eternal life. And because demons hate you, that is why they steal what I gave to you at birth. Destroy your life and kill you. They want you to be with them in the lake of fire forever. So if you also love yourself, reciprocate my love and be on my way of salvation and you will live with me in eternity. That says the Lord. This is Pastor Dr. Kukudazi reporting live from heaven. Yentie ene heaven amane bono. Isanse me do untina me ba asasi so na me be chere o me kwan a e betumi ama o dan kwano na isanse adamo ni susu ta wonti enu ntina wo wa wo mu no wo wiya de e me de ma wo no o sei wa bra bo na wo kun no o mu pese o ko kan wo mu e wo janua enum danu mu afibo enu nti se won soso do ho a eni e fa o do no e bo mi do no ne fa min kwaje kwan no so na e be ma woni mi atena afibo se die eradi sie ni we ye osofo dr kuku dazi mama ni bo a mi di free heaven last week I showed you the role of God's servants and what church is about. That as God's servants, we represent him here on earth. And the church is about God's people who are delivered from demonic bondages, living holy, and are getting ready for heaven. Na wotu e chwe munu, mi chre wo nyamin kwa e juma, eni asore se di e sitye. Eni se, se ye ye nyam kupon en kwa yi, ye si na nemu e wo asasi so. Na asore nso so fa nipa, ya ji wo un e fri adamo ni nshesu wo asi. Na otra si wakunukunu ye mu aso nyamie ni. Na wosie si wawun ako heaven. Amen. It is from this backdrop that I tell you to be in the church where the Lord God Almighty is present to protect you from demons and heal you from every demonic disease. E yesanyi na so inti ena me kachira o se kodom asoria nyankopon tumfo no ewo mu na obetumi abo ho ban na wasa o yare e free adamo ne yare nyina emu if you belong to a church where the pastor has a disease himself and he has to see the doctor always and there is a sick bay at the church premises where nurses Cure the sick church people, it should tell you that God's power is not in the church and in your pastor. So, Doma Soria, O Sofuno and Casa, Ewa Yarebi, Ewa Nipedremo, Nadebia, Esse, O Kohu Dokutani, 
na afen so so wo asore na sase no eso ho no yesi dan bia ayare hwefo wo mu a wo mu ne sa asore fo no ayare no yare dia ese se ka kire wo se nyankopon ni asore no ene usofo no you belong to a human organization you don't belong to the church of god wudom ni pada seniko wudom nyankopon asore because in the house of god god heals his children as he promised in exodus chapter 15 verse 26 Isanse wo nyankopon fie no nyankopon sa ne mayare ye se de o she gbo e wo exodus ngoma no ti dunum chichemu adionu ensianu God does not send his children to a human being he created for him to heal them when they are sick he himself delivers his children from demonic oppression and heals their diseases nyankopon emfane mankoma enipa da senia ono na bose senima yare a wonsa won yare e ono ankasa ene jine ma free adamo ni sheso ase na osa won yare won ina therefore if your pastor has nurses and a doctor at a sick bay on the church premises to cure church people when they are sick ask your pastor the whereabouts of god in his church enu ti se usofu wo ayarehwefu wo ni doctor fo wo eden bi aye si wo asore na sase no so se emu na wo nsa asore fo a wo yare no yare a bisa usofu no se nyankopon wo hen e wo na sori no ask him why god is not healing his children as he promised but human beings are doing that bisanu de entia nyankopon en sane ma yare e se de o she bo no ne mom ni pa da sani e na ye sa and if after seeing the doctor still the church people die from demonic diseases like cancer ulcer kidney malfunctions liver malfunctions stones in the blood heart problems asthma and many more it should tell you that seeing the doctor doesn't prevent demons from killing the church people na se o ko un doctor na se ni ina chi no asori fo no gusu a wu e free adam on yare e bit se kokura mi yare a eni edro no ye fu yare e din din pa sabu a hu a tochi ma brebo a hu a tochi ma abuo a wo mojanum akuma yare e asma eni bebre ki ka ho a ese se ka kire wo se se wo hu dokuta ni no eno no en si adamo ni kon se ontu min kum asore fo no a doctor who is a mere human being without god's power cannot prevent demons from killing people dokuta ni a o ye ni pada se ni keka oni nyami to me no on to me si adam on the coin say mama won come ni pa it is only god who has power to prevent demons through his genuine servant e ye nyankopon kwan and e what to me o be to me afa na kwa kan so e die si adam on the coin say mo on yesa So if your pastor cannot stop the pain that demons inflict on the church people through prayer 
it should tell you that he is empty and God is not in him. And this is so fun to me from Pibo and see Yahweh Adamone did go as sorry for this one. As I said, catch you, say, or soften or dampine, nanyan kupon, ednedemo. He has bewitched you and the other followers with enticing words of human wisdom. You all follow him without reasoning about these things. Bibina, wo huwa guu, ene ne chidi fwoni ina niso. A ode ni pada seni seme de achemu enunti na mudi na chi wa bra monjen jen we ni mina ehono. You all follow him blindly. Mina mudi na chi ewe ni frayemo. If you are not bewitched by the pastor, but reason with your own minds. You will be very worried about the inability of the pastor to stop demons from attacking the church members. Senye bibi na sofu ne huwa guma niso. Ena muanka sa mudi ma jwen pa ne jwenia. Nkebe habo pa se. O sofu ne inti min si adamo ne kwen se. Ma won tu inche asafu manuso. If a doctor is the one who has to heal church people when they are sick, then it's better to stay at home and read your Bible. Mm -hmm. And when you are sick, you go to the doctor for healing. Mm -hmm. eh? mm -hmm. That is what you should do. Say, Doku Teni, and I say, I'm sorry for no yari, I say, or someone yari, and I say, and I say, I'm not going to be a working car or Bible. And I say, I'm not going to be a doctor, and I say, I'm not going to be a doctor. So I say, it doesn't make sense to be in an organization that is supposed to be of God. But God is not present to heal his people. It doesn't make sense at all. And to say, Nimkura say, Uba dom e kuwa, E patre se, E nyankupon dia. Na e susu nyankupon nimwa, Obe sa, Nimkura fwa yari. And to say, Nimkura. Well, is God in that church? Why is God not present there? Why is it that you don't see God's power and His healing in your church? Why? Nyankupo wohin ewa sorum. Adenti na nyankupo ni sa sorum. Adenti na unhuru nyankupo to me and na yarsa ewa sorum. If these things are missing, it's obvious that God is not in that church. It is just a human organization, as I said. Say, when you mean a Nihodia, a dead pefe say, Yankopon, a near sorrow, na a nipper does any cool keke, said the Makan. Because in God's true church, he is always present to heal his people. Mm -hmm. He backs his word with his power through his anointed servant. You should always see the supernatural manifestation of God's power. That is how it is in the house of God. Amen. The beer or Na odini tumi pa eta na kwa wasra ne wono asem echi. Ese se de biya uhu nyanku pon tumi mwa mwa so pa odane dieno. Sa ene se se ye ewo nyanku pon efie. It is God who heals his people with his supernatural power. Therefore, it is medical doctors who should refer their patients to God for healing after they have done all that they can but can kill the patients. Eye nyanku pon ene dini tumi ngwa ngwa suwa sanin kurofo yare. Enunti 
e ye dokuta fuo ne se se. Wabra woma ye di omu beye biya. Na wang tu min sa yari fuo yari eno. Wadi wang e konyan kuponche. I told you last week that doctors admit that they don't know the causes for many diseases. Na ochu ye chue mwono me kanchi yo se. A dokuta fuo jitumu se. Wobu nimi yariye bebre faribayi. Eni diye kofa baye. That is why sincere doctors recommend to patients who suffer from some incurable diseases to seek spiritual help through prayer from God's anointed servants. Mm. That is how it's supposed to be. Enunti, ena doku tafuwa wamu kano kwa repaano. Wamu kachira yarifuwa. Wamu wa yaria. Wasa enye yye nise. Wamu kwa wifi sun sumu mwa. Enfri nyanku pa kwa wasa ni mwa. E wampai bomu encheni. Sa, ene se se, eye. That doctors should always see God as the final solution. Ene se, de biya, doku tafu obe hunya mi se, onu na oka, e chato. But because today's pastors are spiritually empty, they rather see doctors as the ones who have the final say. That is why they refer church people to them for healing, as I've been telling you. Then Susue San said, Neya Sofono, Sunsum Womu Dampainti, Womu Dokuta Fose, Womu Momune Kandi Katuo, and Nunti Neya, Omu Dia Sorif Woko Ma Omu Se, Wonko Na Won Sa Won Yariya, Me Gusua Me Kachira Woyin. Such pastors make it seem as if when God feels, then doctors take over. Mm. Hey! Hmm. It's serious. Oh. Very serious. It's as if doctors do what God cannot do. Hmm. Hey! Hey! Sa sofono, eh mana kamia yese, se nyanku pon en tu mi anya, na dokuta fono mo asomwa ye. Hey! Eh, ha, jim, pa, o. Ha. Ube, ka, se, di, e, doku, ta, fu, onu, mo, mi, ye, di, e, nyan, ku, pa, on, tu, mi, ye. Ha. What such pastors imply is that, doctor, God cannot heal his people. That is why we are sending them to you for healing. Ha. That is a big insult to God. Ha. Di, e, sa, so, fu, on, e, pa, che, ni, se, Doctor, nyanku ponti me insanin krofono yari ou. E nunti na edi omu obre ou se, sa omu yari eno. Ay! Na e ya tem di die ke siye pa, e di me nyami. If you are a pastor with such a mentality, you don't know who God is. That is why you insult him like that. You are a sinner who belittles God. Mm-hmm. Se wu ye sofu na wa gini niya. U nimi nyame. E nunti na wu didi na temono. Wu ye dibon ye niya. U me nyame e ye kituwa. You are just making money out of God's church. You are spiritually empty. E ye nyanko pa sore hon. E na wu didi e di apiska. Sun sun mono. That is why you don't understand that it is doctors who should rather refer their patients to God, not the reverse. Mm-hmm. It is God who takes over from doctors. It is not doctors who take over from God. Eye nyami ene somu fri dokuta fwo nsem. Ne momi nye dokuta fwo ene somu fri nyanko ponsem. 
if doctors take over from God, why is it that at times on the operation table, a patient loses his life? Mm. Why? Why can't the doctors bring the patient back to life? Mm. Why? It should tell you that doctors don't have control over the breath of life of their patients. Mm. Se dokuta fone so mu fri nyanko pon se mu dia. Adenti na to de bia. Wa bra ya pipe ni panu mu ni edi na tu pono so ye ne ho adwuma no. Ni pano ehre ne nkwa no. Adenti a. Adenti na ya dokuta fono emfa yare ni no ensa amankom no. Ese se ka kire wo se ayare fo nkwa no. Eni wo mu ho me no. Eni adokuta fo nsem. People's breath of life is under the control of the Almighty God only. Amen. Ni pan kwa eni wong hume no e shenyan kupon kwa ensem. That is why when someone loses the breath of life, doctors say that when that happens, we can't do anything to bring the person back to life. Enunti na se obi shre ni nkwa hume enwa. Dokuta fwo kan se se basa yen tumi nye bibia en samfa nipano en man kwa mubiyo. That should tell you the limitations of medical doctors. Ese se no kan bebia dokuta fwo pim echero. So if you claim to be a preacher and you can't see this, you don't know God anywhere. Demons are just using you to belittle God. And unti una o see se we yen sempakeni na untu me hunu we ya. Uni mi nyami o baby ya. A damon in a afa o su keke. Na omu pese omuma ubu nyami en nimti ya mani ya kitikiti. I thank God for medical doctors because I was on the same tangent when God called me. But as the servant of God, I will not put down my God and lift up medicine. Mi denyami asi ma dokuta fo. Isan se, sa akwa enu so a nana mi nam, ene nyankupon efre me. Nen su su se bi ye nyankupon kwe yi. Me mfami nyan kupon ma fom da. E ma e drosu. It is God who created human beings and gave us the brain to study how he made the human body. So there is no way a doctor can know the human body more than God. E ye nyan kupon ne bo ni padaseni. E no ma ye agine. I bet to me a dear sian a quire of fasua or bo ni padaseni and ni pediano. And untien to me mad da se doku teni behunu ni padriano munsem a chen yan kupon da. As a child of God, what should take you to the hospital to see the doctor are things that need to be fixed physically in your body. Like surgery. Injury, medication infusion, blood transfusion, wounds that need stitches and dressing, and delivery of babies as a pregnant woman. These are conditions that need physical human help. And for that, we thank God for the able nurses and doctors. But regarding chronic demonic diseases, it is only my God who has all the power to heal them. Hallelujah. Amen. Se uye nyanku pon banu. Di esese di ukwa yari sabia ema uko hun doku teni ye ni ema. Esese ye ye ni ye hunemu ewo nipedu emu. Bibiti se 
Uko ni ya papa u ni pedu ya kwe mu. Nadi ya tochi ma u munu. Ya hili ye. Anase pra. Anase edrua. Ya digu u ni pedu ya mu. Anase moja. Ah, ya digu u ni pedu ya mu. Anase prebia. Hiyan se yebe tuwa tuwa. Yebe siye siye. Yebe pam. Anase yebe ni ya ma u. Anase. Uye o pimfu o. Na uko uwa. Uye nema. Ehiyan nipada seni mwa. Una mu. Enu diye. Ye denyamia si. Ema ayarechefu o. Eni adoku tafuwa. Uumutumi ebuwa. Ewa saa kwa anasu. Nansu suwe ba adamo ni yari ya. Eye kran kran kran. Usa. Entumi nkodia. Eye unyankupo tufu nkwa. Ene wotumia. Ubitumi diya sedi ila. Hallelujah. Amen. That is why I say that pastors who refer church people to doctors regarding demonic chronic diseases don't know anything about demonic diseases and what God can do. I don't think I may can say, I saw for one of the asa for man who called doctor for one, say, ba Adam on the area, a year crown crow one. Wabu nim bibia fa adamon yari ya hon. Na wabu nsansusu nim diye nyanku pombe tu me aye. And if you don't know anything about demonic diseases and don't have God's healing power in you, it denotes that you don't have God's complete attributes in you. De sa wu nim shi e fa adamon yari ya hon. Na wu nim nyanku pombe a yari sa tu me ni wabu mwa. Asiye che se, u ni nyan kupon, e su ni nyan, e wa umo. And I want you to understand that, God does not send people, who don't have his complete attributes, to represent him on earth. He doesn't do that. Na mi pesa u ti asiye se, nyan kupon, suma ni pa, wa umo ni, ni su ni nyan, e wa umo no se, wa umo nko si na ne mo, e wa sa si su, da, because such people will be incomplete. They cannot help those who seek God completely. It's answer. Nipa ti sa ano. Omu soso. Omu ye nipa. Omu nye mwa. Na omu ntumi mwa nipa. Omu ba shi fe nyame. E wo mwa kwa so anase. E wo adi bia emu. Such people will use their carnal minds. To lead people and misrepresent God. Ni pe ti sa anon. Womu di womu anka sa jen. E ni be di ni pe nim. Na womu ayyadi a be che se. Womu nsi nyan kupon anemu. When the Lord Jesus called the apostles. He trained them very well. To have all his attributes. Before he mandated them. To go into the world. With his gospel. And they operated just as the Lord operated. Yes. Wabre radi Yesu Christo fre e siyan fwa no. Wati ti wa omu yye pa. E bo omu nyani suni nina. E vye. Ansana osma omu se. Omu mfana se mpano enko vya se. Na omu koye e juma no se di e radi ye e ni di e no pe 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 pe. They preached. And there was power behind their words. They didn't just preach to people and after that turn them away without any spiritual help. They also cast out demons from people and healed their diseases just as the Lord did for people. Oma nkenya misem anchire ni pa keke. Ne nou echi nou. Na oma pam ni pa ni mo omu ko. Wa bra wa mo omu osun sou mo. Omu sou tutu adamo ni fri ni pa mo. Na wa sa wa on yariye. Se di eradi Yesu Christo nsou. E ye ma ni pa no. So, if you claim to be an apostle. Or a preacher. And you only talk to people about God. And nothing happens after your talking. You don't represent God. 
you are doing your own thing for money. And until we now see us, we are smart for. And now, some pakani na udi oka nyanku pon hu asem chere ni pakeke na oka se wi a enu achi bibi ensi a unsi nyanku pon nem wa wa di bi na wi ye di apeska if you are really an apostle of the lord jesus christ why are you not doing what the apostles of the lord did and continue to do eh mm. why say we ye a radi Jesus Christ to suma for pa. Adenti na wonye nema a radi Jesus Christ to suma for ne ye ye. Na ye guso a ye ye. Adenti Why are you not casting demons from the bodies of your church members for their freedom? Adenti na wuntu tu adam wone em free wasafu man ni pedu yemu ema wamfa wahunko diye. Why are your church members suffering from demonic problems and dying rampantly? Adentina wa safu mane huna mane e free adamoni haumu na wo wupi sa. As you preach to your church people, can you preach about Mark chapter 16 verse 17? Can you? That in the name of Jesus you should cast out demons? Eh? Wabra u Kenyam sem achre wasafu manu. E di ube tu mi akasafa mako asempa. Ti dunsi antiche mu dunso hon. Se. Wo yesu di mu. E se se ututu ahon umoni ana. Eh? Why are the signs that the Lord Jesus said they will follow those who believe in him not seen in your church. Why? Adentina and Centenia, a radi Yesu Christo can say, a bed di woma, woma jini di ene chino, yen hunu bi wo, wa sorry dem wo, Adentia. All these indicate that the pastors who cannot cast out demons from the bodies of their church members don't have the Holy Spirit in them. They have put titles on themselves to look big on the outside. But inwardly, they are empty. Demons are not afraid of them. Where you mean, I say, I saw one woman to me to two other money, and free or massa for money, Pedro Mono. Woman need Yame Hong Kong, a woman. Woman, they are bodina, Cassia, to two to two woman so. Said ye bear omu bay almost almost so soon a nipa cassia a wa bonting a dia chinipa. Nansu so kukuomu any womumuno. She ni womumu. A damon and so omu. That is why they can't receive spiritual answers from God for their church members and can't tell what is wrong with them spiritually. Enunti na wamu nti mi nya sun sun mu emwayen sem. Emfri nyan kupon hon ma wasafu manu. Na wamu nti mi nsu sun ka de ha wamu sun sun manu. That is why when demons kill their church members, they console themselves by hiding under this sentence. It is God who gives. And it is God who takes. And until as a demon is come, we must have a manual. Now, we must be a rechitcher. We must be a kasaho. Now, we must go see what the same way as he say. He is a coupon of demon. Now, we must go see what the same way as It's because they can't explain. Why demons kill their church members without resistance? Mm. That is why they judge wrongly and think that every death is from God. As it said, Cynthia, Adam, and Kum Kum, Oma, Safu, Manoa, Obian to me, see one no coin, Omu to me, Jazzy, and Untina, Omu Bua Tenchia. Na a year, Oma Jane said, Obia, a free Yamino. 
It's because they don't hear from God and don't know anything spiritually. Let me explain this to such spiritually empty pastors and know who explained it to you. My main church is a church that is a software that is a sunsum, a woman damp. I am a nipa or a church that is a church. It is not every death that is from God. And yet, it will be a in a free name. People can die from the three ways I'm going to show you. So, if you don't know and you blame every death on God, you judge wrongly. Any pobe to me, I will cry me and sir, me betcher we as well. And not is a wood name, Nessa, a woe be an old shenya me now born a subo or one. Ubu attentia. One, demons can kill, as the Lord said in Matthew chapter 10, verse 28, that do not fear those who kill the body. Two, Demonic agents who have demonic powers can also kill people who are not spiritually protected. If you are not protected spiritually, demons and their agents can easily take your life. And three, God can also take someone's life if he wishes. These are the three ways by which people can lose their lives. The Edikan, Adam and Betumia Kum said the Radikan or Matthew as sympathy do, Chichi Mordio no more chin say, and throw one more, one more Betumia Kum, Nipeduano. The Tosumeno, Adam and Yesia never move for one more Adam and two men. Womususubetumi so if you think that every death is from God, you don't qualify to be a preacher because you don't understand spiritual things. And don't say, I describe such people as Spiritual illiterates. It's my own description, eh? So don't steal it from me. Me dance anko for ne di se. Womu ye nipa susumu omu nimdi. Mi ana me kasa for omu when we am free So if demons or their agents kill your church members, and you blame the death on God by saying it is God. Who took such people away, your judgment is wrong. I don't see that money, and I say, Oh, my see a name for a cum was a fumba. Nessa, oh, boy, you miss a boy, I was a woman who now can say, A yamine fast uncle for no coya or Timon, and yet, what boy attend here? You have blamed the innocent God. You have worsened your case. What bo nyankupon ni huni asembia no subo na asay wasemkra. When Job said, "It is God who gives, and it is God who takes," his judgment was wrong. If that is what you don't know and you want to copy, because at that time. Job didn't know that it was Satan who killed his children. 
wabra jobu kanse e ye nyame na de ba na ono ankasa so na eje no a wonim na enu na opese usua no na na temu ono nye e sanse sabre no na jobu nim se na e ye bosam e na okum ne ma no job didn't know that it was not god who took the lives of his children na job nim se na nye nyame e na ji ne ma no nko efri wo no so if you are a pastor and you also attribute every death of your church member to god and say that it is god who gives and it is god who takes <laughs> you are very funny oh. you don't know anything spiritually anunti se wo ye sofo na se wo de wo bia wo sofo ma ne be wo no wo ko ka se e nyame na di ba na odo a na ji a wo esri pa wo nim bibia sunsun you are just judging wrongly about the deaths of your church members wo bu atanchia e fa wo sofo ma no wo eh and it is very shameful to call yourself a pastor but can't know the spiritual causes of the deaths of your church members na eni wu se wo be fra ho sofo na untumi hunu sunsun mu sentia wa safo manu ewu ye interestingly as the pastors judge wrongly their church members also do the same any can say me say wa bra sofo no ebu atenchia no wo mo asafo man so so yes abi when the members of such churches die mysteriously they also judge wrongly by saying that it is god who gives and it is god who takes they are also following their pastors say asafo man wa e wo san so no mo so wo mu wu wa bra wo mu ntiasi a wo mu so so bu atenchi aka se e ye nyame na dima na ono anka sa so na eje wo mu so so di wo ma sofo na chi the members also think that every death is from god that is why they also blame god they don't know what i have explained because they follow a pastor who does not understand spiritual things and cannot hear from god omo nim chechere mo me dia men e san so omo di sofoa onu ntumi ntihwe mfri nya me ho achi na sunsun mo so ontihwe yasi such church members don't know that demons their agents and god can take people's lives sa sa fu man so so nim se adam money wo mo si anem mo fo eni nyame e betimi aje ni pankwam e fri wo mo sem what is sad is that at times some parents use witchcraft to sacrifice their own children for their demons mm. and later blame god and use the same words mm. it's very very unfortunate very, very. hi that is a very serious allegation against god dey mm. are who ni say e to da bia awofo binum e di beye e di wo man kasa ma bo afori e ma wo ma da money na o ma san bo nyan coupon sobo na o ma kasa ansem gro na bi o ha e ya dia e ha dwin pa so we be twa sem atu nyan coupon so if you are a pastor or a parent and you sacrifice your church members or your own children for your demons and you blame god for such deaths you judge wrongly and you worsen your case as i said so we are sofu anasa owofo now the wasafu manu ba for e ma wada money anasa ukum wan kasa u mama wada money na chire u bonya me subo e wosa wuo no ho a ubu atenchia na o sei wasem kra so you can see that wrong judgment about death 
is going on in all the churches. Until we to me, I will say, Attention, I for woman, sa ne koso, a one surrounding him. And it's all because the pastors and their church members don't have the Holy Spirit. So they can't receive spiritual answers from him. Naningina as it said, Sa soft warning you are safu man, woman ni nyame unkrum krum. And unto woman to me nyasun sumu e mwaye biara em free neho. That is why they rely on medical doctors for healing and not on God. And untina womu de womu to a dokuta for so se wona wonsa wa yare ne mum enye nyamenu. If you want to see the power of God in your life, live holy. Be under God's genuine and anointed servant so that when he prays for you, God will answer and show himself strong in your life. In Jesus' name, amen. Amen. So person who in your coupon to me will abrabo more. Bo abrabo crum crum. Matina yamia qua was son of more kind and nasty. Said the abaya or bumpire mawa. Yan coupon be bois. No, I done what this room coa or dimu pa. A wabrabo mu. A wa yes to dainty. Amen. If you want to escape. Demonic diseases and deaths come and hide under the shadow of my Lord Jesus Amen. as you pray this prayer with me. So, who pese u jane adamo ni yari eni omu uwa brabe she mira Yesu Christo ni nyunasi wabra one me bosa ampaye Lord Jesus Eradi Yesu I thank you for speaking to me today. I accept that I am a sinner. But from this day forward, I believe in my heart and confess with my mouth that Jesus, you are the only Lord. Forgive me of all my sins. And write my name in the book of life. Let your Holy Spirit dwell in me. And I will live a holy life to please you. Thank you for saving me. In Jesus name. Amen. Amen. Father thank you. For speaking to people, for them to understand what your church is about and the role of your genuine servants, so that they will not be in the hands of empty preachers for demons to destroy their lives. In Jesus' name, Amen. Amen. O ni adofo a uti e ye e e ye AP Radio 105.7 na bi a na o pese uti e ensem yi bi mu a o beti e e wo AP Radio he ya u kwada eni fiada enyume no nson e ye Dr. Kuku Dazi Ifrim eno o de nyame asem kroji e fi e sorosoro bre o o ni adofo bi a na o hwehwe ye kira kwai na o pese wo de ye Ye wo holy land a e wo kumase kase. Kumase kase no. Feeling station e wo wun se di faso. Na abatwa wun se be nkum nusu. Na feeling station si no. Die di ka die to sumye no. Tira die to sumye no na. E kwa e da die to sumye no ni nche mu. E sane kofom. Fasa kwa anu so a kusi fom chai. Ube mu holy land. Na ene kusi ada sum no. E ye no nkum bra na ni emeso ukwada enwumri no num ne fa e ye bible ade sue ene fiada enwumri no num ne fa so e ye mpaibo 
na asemni nyina mebonu tofu a na chese eye atenchia nyame asofo eni nipa ebu na yekami yese nyame eni tumi bia ana ye bre nyame tumi ase ebi ni se yari ha edide nipa so a e wose nka wote osofo papa na asia e wose sofo no bom pa ye ma ono no ose fa ko nipa da sani ho a wo ye doctor doctor ye anso ebi ho a wo ye operation a wo bom pa ye bi se nyame an sa na wa ye doctor ye anso yari ebi ho a wo se wo hunu ne fa reba ntimo fa compatible nanso enka wo se e ye se asofo no bom e na de doctor se ntimi no wo mumum eje bom pa ye ana se yare ye ahohom mone yare ye omo bom pa ye ma nipa no na doctor fonso aye omo so nipa de a ye di ye ni hu afamudi na de ye ma re ho eni se omo fa ho se nipa na o yare ye no so be wu so ohun ni nyina ni aso a eh so bo no abo awrade yi so a o ti ni be bi a waka se ayare se to mi ifri no Na na me se wo mu no wo mu ni aya se to mi bia de abo ni padinti. Wo refer wo da ko ko wu a wo si nyame ne de ma nyame ne je. Na ene de ye papa a chire mu job asem no pa me ehunu se. Na job ni me se. Asama wo ka no. Ne ma ne wu wu ye no. E ye bo sam an aseta. Ene kunkum wo mu ne nye nyame. Enu na ni pe ni ma asofo e isu ni ma o ma fa ya asama obi e ka bi e ma nipa so ka bi ma wo mo se wo ma sam kra wo nyame anim e san se wo a wo ye nipa no kra no so obi ka asam show na enye sa na asam ne tia wo ni bere na emom se nyame a wo ti ni ba bi na ahohomani akum obi ana wo mo ejente akum obi ni kra wo asofo no wa na wo sacrifice wo nipa dia ma ahohomani na wo dia she nyame a nyame o be bi sa o de bi na ni so be bre o enu nti ye nyae sansam ne ka na ye me nyame enye nyame onye na djuma se nyame na de eye ni pa fam de enso ye fema nipa da nyame sha amen amen mama onua me jidi se wati de fere na sori ase enye ni pa da se ni ku wati ye nyame ma eno wa sansu so ahu Nipa, your friend is suffer, and your German so, yeah, yeah. And this I wouldn't name way, and I said, Fowl, now I'll call two much, and I saw the beam, no, what now, pe, what? Uber quack or sheer fibre with Janua, and num dan muqua. And it is old dog who pa. Dom, I saw the young yammy womb. Now bet to me, I can say, what the womb for your damn money, Sam? Let's say, who fills our season so, owning yammy, I could transfer fibre. Sa na shim power nyanko ponse me nyawati. My dear, I believe you have understood what church is about. That it's not a human organization that you just throw yourself within and you don't care what goes on. Demons can easily kill you and you will burn forever in hell. I believe that you have also understood who a servant of God is and his role. We gather God's people and deliver them from demonic oppression and let them live holy for the Lord God Almighty. So if you don't want to die and burn forever in the hellfire, come to church or join the church that God is present in so that you can say that you are free from demons. And when you die, you can be with God forever. That is what Ashim Power is about. That is why God wants me to tell the whole world all the time that with God, all things are possible. God bless you.